So once again, guys, it's Baron J67 with LV1 Gaming, and we're just testing out the full spectrum of the Aviga headset from Avid. Now, I personally wanted to try out the 3.5 uh, mm jack in order to plug it into my controllers. You know, for your uh, for your Xbox Series X, you know, you got your different controllers. Um, you know, you got your different ports or even for your actual PlayStation controllers, you have the 3.5 port where you could plug in and um, have access to playing on console and whatnot. So if you're a mainly console player, I would highly recommend getting the, um, the 3.5 jack and that's so that you could actually um, you could actually plug it in directly to your controller and get the full experience with no hesitation. It's just plug and play. Now, for me, getting the 3.5 and plugging it into my computer and trying it different ways, I ran into a few hiccups. Um, nothing too crazy. I actually was lucky enough because I had the plug. I had to get a splitter. So for my computer, it is a little bit older and it doesn't have a, I believe it's called um, a TRRS. Uh, it's basically like I, I probably butchered it. it's probably TSSR but I'm not a tech junkie but I'm just giving you a consumer standpoint but what ended up happening was um, my computer didn't have the capability to read the headset and the mic as one unit so I had to use my splitter which split the mic portion uh, and the ability to capture the mic and the ability to send the audio to the headset so that's what the splitter did splitter was like five bucks um, but for me who's going to be using the headset on my PC and controllers um, it was a necessity for my type of PC but if you actually um, uh, there's also the USB a um, version of the Aviga headsets and if you're going to be strictly gaming on PC I highly just recommend getting the USB a version and that's just so that there's no mix up no you don't have to go out and buy another part if you don't already have it um, or check and make sure your computer has a very specific port that's needed but the USB a would be the absolute easiest way to go about it but yeah once again if you guys use code LV1 gaming you'll get 10% off on either your 3.5 or your USB a Aviga headset and you also will get free shipping and it's only $59.95 before the discount so once again guys it is a really good headset I'm actually recording this entire video using the full capability of the headset so the audio you're hearing is the microphone audio I have no filters or anything over it so you guys are getting this is the raw experience with and for me it's the raw experience with a splitter recording through my PC uh, but yeah I'll make sure to put the link to the splitter just in case you do end up needing one and you want a 3.5 so that you can go back and forth um, but yeah I, I'm liking the headset it's comfortable I've spent hours using it um, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep using it keep bouncing back and forth just to get the full experience put it through its wear and tear and also another cool part is the way that the mute function works on the headset so there's no button or anything like that it's all mechanical and I'm gonna switch it back and you guys should be able to hear me again and I think that's super cool because it's super dope super easy to fix and it's it's a for sure way to know you're not you know speaking into the mic once again when I don't want you to hear anything I'm gonna keep talking 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 and now I'm back and this is a really cool function really cool feature and once again these are great headsets from Avid um, and the price is right you know gaming should be for everybody and this is a good way and a low cost way to level the playing field so you can get the full experience and not miss anything like somebody creeping up behind you on your left you'd be able to hear them um, but yeah I'm Baron J67 make sure to check all the links below much love peace